Sorry, I had to try to stop that. Okay. So this TV right here, I found this TV on uh, by the trash bin across the street, sitting on a chair. In fact, I will go ahead and step outside. I will show you the chair. See that chair right there by the trash can? That is where the uh, TV was sitting on. And I know it rained last night, but the TV wasn't there last night. But I went out there to take the dogs out. I saw this TV there, and I'm like, wow. That's a big TV. It was heavy, too, trying to get up my stairs. Ooh, my back hurts. But I started thinking, you know, I brought it in here to see if it works. I mean, like, who throws out TVs, you know? And I understand people want to get an upgrade because, you know, they got the better definitions, higher depth, whatever, HDMI ports and whatnot. But um, to me, people like me who low income, who can't hardly afford anything, I mean, I'm lucky enough to get stuff that has HDMI or I've already got stuff to have HDMI hookup. This is just a classic TV. I mean, this is a big old, uh, this is a big boy here. I mean, look at that. I mean, the back of it, I'll show you the back of it. This is the, the back hookups pretty much. A, B, and coax. That's about it. That's the only hookup. And I, I, I thought I would need a uh, programmable remote to um, to work with this. But I was really uh, happy to know that in front here, it's got right here, it says TV video. So if I can just push that, it goes between video 1, 2, and TV. Okay. And it's got my menus and the channels up. So... I'm like, I don't need a remote for it, so. And so, what you're seeing here, of course, is the classic uh, PlayStation uh, CD player from the original PlayStation. I bought this at the, uh, at the Etcetera store here in town, Weatherford, for 20 bucks, which I thought was kind of steep. I mean, I should have got it for 10 because it only came with a power cord, and I wasn't sure if it was going to work. But instead, I went ahead and just paid the 20 and um, I, I already had an AV cable for it. I just did not have a remote uh, controller, which I did find a remote. I asked the guy at a pawn shop here in town if he had any uh, PlayStation 1 remotes. So he did. Um, it's kind of, it's a little sensitive. The, uh, that left uh, thumbstick is a little sensitive, but um, it's, it's still good. It's still good. Um, that was three bucks. That was three bucks. Three. So it's twenty-three bucks for a new PlayStation. So, well, not new, but for me, I mean, a used, new in my house system. Okay. I mean, not that I'm gloating about a PlayStation because I mean, over here I do have a PS3 system, right there. That's my PlayStation 3. I know it doesn't look like your normal. Um, uh, PlayStation um, uh, 3 hookups, but uh, yes, in fact, if you can see right here on the letters, it does say PS3 right up there. I'll try to get a zoom in on that for you. That does say PS3. Uh, crystal white is what it is, came in, so a lot of my friends are like kind of jealous because, you know, I can, that's the, it, it just doesn't go in like no, normal PS3s. Um, so yeah. So like I'm not very, you know, not to be hyped about the PS1, but I am a little bit because I can now play my music generator properly, okay? Because um, even though the, the music generator, the MTV music generator, can play on the PS3, it won't work properly on the PS3. Um, and recently I just figured out I did try to play it again on my PlayStation 1 and there are some of the riffs that won't load up so I'm going to give that another cleaning do the CD a cleaning oh my life has been so busy not 
I do a lot of rearranging in my house. Um, this uh, I've been preoccupied with being lazy and whatnot that I just don't want to do any videos. But I do I do need to do more videos for you guys because um I I don't know what I am. I'm just a, I moved all, all my uh, collections of the videos over here collection. Got my wig woman right up there. It's my uh. I made this little uh, handmade, handmade uh, like this holds the uh, styrofoam heads. I can put the wigs on, style them, whatever. And th this is not glued, so I can get some more like um, pipes to uh, expand it and add more to it. So if, uh, but if anyone's interested in, you know, wanting to buy like a uh, little homemade wig stands, you know. Or homemade stance if they have plenty of these for their wigs or whatnot and they need something to put those on because that just comes off you know uh, I'll, I'll probably make some for you I, I don't know how much I'll cost but um, I mean I got plenty of pipe to do it I might have to get some more um, little elbows and tees and whatnot for it um, so yeah so Let's run about to see how many TVs I've got now. I've got one TV over there that I also found on the uh, by that trash bin right over there outside. It belonged to the neighbors. The only thing that's, that's wrong with it is that when uh, it comes on, all these white dots all over the screen. And when you're looking at darks, uh, when screens get uh, bright, I mean, you can see a bunch of little black dots. It's like white and black dots all over the place. But still pretty good. You can still see the TV and, and, and whatnot. It's like watching a video in space, pretty much, okay? Got one TV there. I got two TV here. There are two in the living room. Uh, here's a third one right here that I just picked up. And as we go back here, you know this? Uh, oh my gosh, I forgot to do this. Hang on. There's my, there's a fourth TV right there. Okay. So, all right. Got four TVs that work and two TVs that don't. I got six TVs all together. If I can get those two working, it'd be awesome. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot one thing. I forgot one more thing. Not only do I have four TVs that work and two TVs that don't, that I could afford, probably hope to get it fixed up, but to top things off, this that cost me 50 bucks at Walmart when they were on sale, it's a home theater uh, projector. So it's got HDMI port. It can, like, you know, play video and sound. And I saw a better one there at Walmart, it's more expensive, that it can hook up via internet and watch Netflix and stuff because it has apps. That's, that's what's going on. Oh, and right here, ladies, just to let you know, I probe on the first date. Yep. And to you other ladies, I am a gamer, so there's, there's my picture right there. That's when I had short hair. Yeah. What am I holding? Okay, I'm holding a, a PlayStation 3 controller and an Xbox One controller. With a, a, a 360 Xbox 360, I'm sorry. That's a 360 controller and my PS3 controller with a shirt that says "Addict" on it because I'm a gamer. On it. Why am I showing that? I'm so fucking conceited right now. Okay, I am just busy, busy. I got like a bunch of crap to go through. Um, I got so much stuff I got to do in my house. I got to do more rearranging because. Okay, ever since I moved here in 2013, no, 16, was it 13? Yeah, 2013, I believe. I have never been satisfied with anything, how I arrange my house, but also when I have new roommates to come in and out, I'm always rearranging and the feng sway, feng sway. So, with that said in mind, uh, 
I am just out of breath right now. I did put that TV there. I had to rest for a bit before I made a video. I'm playing um, the song you heard at the beginning. I don't know what number it was on. It's... Here we go. It's Culture Club. Um, don't mind if I do soundtrack. So, I don't know what number it was on, and I don't want to get in trouble with any copyright laws, but, um, yeah, so that's, uh, at least, you know, I'm not selling it, so that's cool. Uh, yeah, been a while since I've been on here. Yeah, I've, um, Actually, uh, what I have been doing, I've been, um, excuse me, uh, whenever I get paid, um, I go out and I bought like a, a box set series or something. And last last box set I bought before the one I bought now, uh, I bought like, um, yeah, it's about January of this year, I bought the Married with Children a box set, complete 11 season series. And I'd be watching that over yeah, well, not the whole series over and over, but I'd watch the entire series, and um, it would last me about about a month and a half or so. And then I start watching. Um, that's when I was binge watching it. Then I started actually playing like a, a DVD of it while I go to bed and just let it play, so I can have something sight and sound while I go to sleep. Um, but then recently, uh, last month. So, I bought um, the complete series of Roseanne uh, before Walmart would have a chance to pull it out, if they did, at the Roseanne's little tweet. And that looks like I got, like, water on there. Nope. Yeah, just a glare. Um, when the new series of Roseanne's came out, um, uh, after Roseanne made this tweet that got that show pulled... I know I had to get the box set before Walmart decided to pull it off the shelves. If they ever did. I'm not sure if they did or not. But um, I'm glad I bought it before they ever got a chance to. So um, so I've been watching that. I'm not done with the series yet. Um, I bought a new um, device for my computers. It's called uh, Easy VHS to DVD. I can just plug in um, the cord from my VHS into this little device. I'll show you what it is. Um, this here. This right here. This is what it is right here. Um, I would plug in the audio and video into these right here. Or S video components right here. And then I plug this in into the computer. And then, with the program that it came uh, with it, I uh, use it to I play a VHS and I can save it on my computer. Or I can just automatically make a DVD of it. But I can save it to my computer and I can make a DVD later and whatnot. It also came with like, uh, I, can do the, I can do this for also, um, uh, stereos like uh, um, records audio cassettes turn them digital um, so that's another reason why I'm going to be extra busy in my next few months or so um, I just ordered a 100 pack set of a DVD plus R DLs um, cause the, the DLs are dual layer, they hurt, they hold a lot more than just a regular, uh, DVD-R. Um, that way I can, uh, copy stuff from my VHS's onto those. Um, I had a friend that wants to do a series of Gainther videos. I, I don't know who Gainther is, apparently he's a, a, a preacher, entertainer, evangelist of some sort or another. Could be a band, I don't know. I think it's a it's a Christian thing, but um, ooh, I'm sweating up a storm over here. Hang on a second. He wants to get some of those. 
I promised a friend I'd make some deep, some whew, DVDs for them. But I basically want to do it for myself. And I have a special uh, DVD prepared for someone. I'm not going to mention names on here. But uh, they're going to get that pretty soon. Or not pretty soon, but, you know, sometime. Um, so I had to order them online, so they're going to be mailed. And I don't know when they're going to be here. So um, until then, I am copying. I've been copying stuff on my... Um, the, oh, what I did is... Um, uh, this might be illegal, but, you know... Uh, my friend had a, a series of uh, True Blood on um, DVD. And I would like to have that series, of course. So what I did, I, I recorded the entire series of True Blood on my computers. And right now, the entire series is on my big, huge tower computer. It's hard drive. And uh, when I get those DVDs, I'm going to start putting them on my uh, DVDs because... Video takes a lot of memory on a computer. So I, I, I'm almost out of memory on my big computer. Um, I, right now I'm going through old family videos. Some of my own um, homemade videos I did with me and my friends out and, out and just goofing off and whatnot. Um, what I do need to do know, now is find... A, uh, a player that would accept oh wait a minute that's different okay, I'll just grab this camera down here I found this camera at a pawn shop and um, it, uh, it it works somewhat to an extent but it, 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 the audio quality is it's not clear the, the audio doesn't come in clear the video goes out every once in a while. Um, it's an eight millimeter camcorder. Um, high a, a high H is what it needs. That's what it takes, but yeah, eight millimeter uh, film is what I have to have other <sighs> homemade videos, family and friends. But this, though, it can hook up to my TV. The audio is not clear. Video is not clear. So I need to find a brand new one altogether. Because I tried multiple tapes. I thought maybe the tape was bad. But it did did that with all the tapes. Um, so that's a how am I doing on time. My battery is down to two bars. So uh, yeah. That's what's going on around right now. I'm, uh, so yeah. I will be busy. Um. Once I get those uh, DVDs, start making uh, more copies. I got stuff like on VHS's movies, on VHS that I would love to have on DVD. So, um, another thing that might be cool is that um, so like my a PlayStation 3 has an AV output on it, but so does my Xbox 360. But the PlayStation 3 plays the Blu-rays. So, I take the output of that, plug it in into the uh, computer, take Blu-ray Blu -ray quality, copy that, and then put that on DVD, see what happens. Uh, I don't know what would happen, but, you know, it'd be pretty darn sweet, right? Um, so, yeah, that, that's what's going down. Um, as far as my busy schedule... Um, like I said, Sundays is church day, and Wednesdays is rehabs, and I'm free other days. So I'm doing pretty good right now. Um, I just gotta find time to make more videos. And I was thinking maybe, like, it'd be cool if, like, if I get a fan base following. Because I still have, like, a bunch of my original, like, videos saved. I could put those like all onto a DVD format, but um, that would just be a waste of a DVD format if nobody wants one, right? I mean, why well, watch it? You can go on YouTube, right? You know, so anywho. But uh, I guess it'd be best like if people who um, want like a whole collection they can get to without having to worry about um, 
loadings or ads being played and stuff like that, you know, something that they can take on the go. So, it'd be kind of like an official thing, you know. Something, yeah. So, I don't know. I'm, 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 I'm thinking out, out of the blue. Okay. If there's anything you want me to do or whatnot, um, I'm still checking my battery power. I mean, I know there's a lot of YouTubers out there that just sits the cam down right in front of them. And they go through like a horde of shit that they have, you know. Um, they, they would talk about, you know, what they would buy. They would try on things that they would get or try to taste food that they just got. Anything that's just not normal, you know. Um, so, so I want to do something like that for, for YouTube. Um... But I'll probably need a more catchy name. I just like my name right here. It's a, I like my channel right here so far. It's, it's, it's just me. It's open. I'm not trying to be somebody. I'm not. So it's all cool. Um, so yeah. Anything you want to see? Any dares or tricks or whatnot? Just, uh, hey, leave a message down in the comments. Um, I am working on other um, music. I have written a couple of more parodies. I'm just uh, working on my singing abilities. I mean, well, I can sing, but like, I don't want to make it sound like I'm screaming into the microphone because it doesn't make the audio of the video clear. So that's that's what I'm doing now. So. <coughs> I'm drinking a Pepsi with Michael. The choice of Michael's generation. I'm not a kid, but you know Michael touched me a couple of times. Not this Michael, another guy named Michael. I'm just playing now. Um, <laughs> man, I know like I don't know. It's like I know like two Michaels in my life. Yeah, I know two Michaels. You know, I got my friend Michael that lives here in town. And there's this other Michael I know that he's he's more of a friend of my other friend Jason. So, but uh, knowing him, we we used to call him Big Mike. Um, I don't know if I know any other Michaels. So, be, but, um, so anywho, yeah, hit me up with comments, whatever down there, and uh, let me know what you want to see, do, think, party, chill. I don't know. Okay, I'm out. I, I can't think of anything else to say other than, um, bye-bye.